I finally arrived in Johannesburg, South Africa. I was so eager to get to my apartment. Instead of getting an Uber, I overpaid for a taxi. But hey, at least I had some good conversation, got a mini tour, and this man made some money. How far from here did uh, Mandela live? Uh, Zuta. Zuta. That was a hero. Mm -hmm. He was a leader. What's up? Oh, okay. The birds have a whole lot to say. This is my first day in Johannesburg and I'm excited. I'm tired. <laughs> If you can't tell by the eyes, but I'm excited. Although it would be nice and extremely cheap to travel like Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz, click my heels together and just appear in South Africa, the journey from Chicago was a whole trip in itself. forward to my layover in Turkey. I had visited Istanbul years ago in August and it was so beautiful and up until South Africa it was the most different place I had ever been. From the mosque and hearing the call to prayer, countless historical sites, amazing people, food, and exploring the Princess Islands by foot and ferry, Turkey is a really great destination and I'll be back for a longer trip. I had finally packed extremely light one small carry-on, a backpack, and no coat. The night before I left Chicago, I didn't really sleep or eat much, so needless to say, when I arrived in Turkey, I was underdressed, tired, hungry, and my itinerary had completely changed, and I was 100% okay with that. Travel is part planned, part unexpected, and an opportunity to learn along the way.
the stories I have already. Goodness, this trip, it's been a trip already. Oh my gosh. I'm just happy to have food. I've had sleep. I was gonna be out and about doing all these things in the city. I got to this hotel. And I said, sleep. That's on the itinerary. Water, sleep. I wanted food, but water and sleep were number one. And then I was like, okay, food. After however many hours of sleep, then I was like, okay, let me go back out into the elements and get the food. And here it is. I'm so grateful. Period. I just hopped up real quick. <sighs> I'm in Istanbul and I heard them doing the call to prayer. So I hopped up to catch it real quick. All oh, my little stuff. I like these little slippers. They have a couple of them around the room. But yeah, I am just resting, chilling, um, getting on a plane soon. Went out to eat. Um, I was just ordering some food to go and they offered me some tea and a glass cup and a glass saucer and it was like boiling hot i had to ask for a napkin <laughs> to hold it because my american hands were not ready for that type of heat um but i appreciate the hospitality <sighs> yeah and it's interesting um i remember from last time i was in turkey that they have like stray cats and so I saw a stray cat, stray dog, and a stray rooster. And I was like, oh, that's new. So yeah, roosters and chickens. <sighs> but yeah, I'm just listening to the sounds of the cars driving and just getting some rest, you know. The message is slow down. I've heard that from my mom and that is the message for me too. Just slow down. For anyone who needs to hear, slow down. <sighs>
Guys, my dear kids, welcome aboard. This is your captain speaking. Today, our flight with the flight number TK42 from Istanbul Airport. You are the airport with Captain Javier Iglesias, Amer Naci Inca, and myself. Captain Sir Blas will be about approximately nine hours fifteen minutes. As a crew, we are ready for the flight. We expect to start our flight in a short while. During the flight time, the time we expect. Light like motor turbulence, so for all safety, please follow the seat best side. I will give you further information before descent about the weather of the honest book, on behalf of the crew and the entire company. I will talk to you shepherds, right? Thank you. So this is my second day in South Africa in Johannesburg and I'm getting used to the cars being on the other side of the road and walking around as a pedestrian and the weather is nice, it is beautiful, um, I'm in Rosebank, it's very walkable and I'm just excited to be here and share it. It is just beautiful. You can see the beautiful trees and the reflection. And you hear the people, you hear the kids, you hear the birds. It just rained and now it's just, it's just nice. So what time is it? I think it's about five. And things close at like six. So I already went out today. I will order dinner and I'm gonna go to some galleries tomorrow. There's about three art galleries. The Goodman being one and there's two others that I'm gonna go to. So I'm looking forward to that. Yeah.